Welcome back to another video. We are back with my Neko Abby Fox Girl. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's been a long time since I was in a trance and actually tried to do something. It's been like, I'm guessing a month, multiple, I don't know, very long time. And out of the blue, I was hearing a voice. I didn't see anything. Uh, it was more like a, a memory that you can't see. Um, because it, what was said was, okay, I was very tired last night when I was doing this meditation and I think I was a little girl, I don't know what age, I'm guessing six, um, and my aunt goes, come to dinner, and the name kind of just spurred in the moment. Yeah, so that happened, I wrote down the name, but I know it's not in this lifetime, because I have no aunt in this life that I see regularly, um, especially to dinner, so yeah, so that memory was a past life, don't know how it happened, I was just in a meditation and it just happened, how it happened, I, I have no idea, they say you have to focus very hard to access these past life memories. For me, it's just, I, this is not the first time something like this has happened. One other time, I was in the past once again, and I was at a rave party. <laughs> About, like, um, yeah, rave party. Um, I don't know, I, I could hear techno music, I could see crazy laser show going on and other people was there and, and I'm like okay I can't be making this up and yeah spur of the moment wasn't fantasy wasn't made up because I'm not that good with imagination I mean since I'm older like like, can I be an actress? Uh, no. I have no experience in that field, therefore, I can't be making this up. And at times, you feel crazy because you have no evidence that this is actually real, that this is happening to you. Um, what are the... Has anything else crazy happened like that with other memories? Mm, no. I don't really have past life memories other than those two. And the rest is just more of a, a feeling rather than actual evidence of you remembering. How do, yeah, I, I have no real concrete memories uh, other than these two spur of the moment events uh, the other thing that I wanted to say was have I seen other images that floss before me in trances? 
Yes, me- multiple images of this current life, like what I was doing recently or from the past. Okay, for example, I was playing this one video game way too much and I ended up seeing those memories of me playing the game come and flooding back. Like, yeah, that, that happened. Uh, so yeah, images have flooded in rust and like a slide to show, but very fast. Like, um, yeah. But that has only happened like three times now. That has nothing to do with my current life. So it's kind of real, but it has happened. Well, I have seen multiple images flash before my eyes. In a trance. Why it happened? How it happened? I honestly do not know. But it has happened. For me, I do not work in the same way as well human other types of people um they say you have to go into a deep trance and well work at it uh, that's all i can really remember have i researched this to access your past memories it's been ages since i did so my memory is fuzzy when it comes to that but all i know is somehow you have to do it in a deep trance maybe even astral project out of your body and maybe then i don't know how it works but yeah it's a pain in the butt to access that's all i know So, yeah, kind of a weird topic for today. Um, Main and point. Got a name. Apparently I have an aunt from a past life that I know isn't real. Honestly, I don't know. I have a strong suspicion that it could be. Could be real. I don't have enough proof to accept that this is a real thing but yeah happened and out of the out of the blue um It's just pushing towards trying to unlock those deep memories from a past life. We know we have them, we just forgot about them. We don't have the memories in our head and we have to go get them. How? Uh, Astral project, I guess? I don't know. I'm just guessing. I need to do more research on that subject, but spur of the moment for me having multiple images flash before my eyes, still have no idea why that has happened, along with this spur of the moment, hearing a name call me to dinner, so yeah, kind of weird. I thank you for your time and until we meet again.